Bonnie, congrats on your retirement. You've had such a long and fruitful career, and I know that you've adapted to a lot of change from day one until when the practice was acquired um, and all the bells and whistles that went along with it. You have truly been resilient throughout your career, um, and you've also been a very influential part of mine. This is still my first job, and from day one, I felt very supported and loved by you. I have always appreciated your feedback. I know that if I go to you, you'll have an honest and sincere, kind answer. And I've always appreciated having you on my side. And from another perspective, being your patient, I remember the first time I got a cleaning with you, it was like I was listening to the radio. I never felt pressured to respond to things while you had a bunch of instruments in my mouth, but you just sat there and you were entertaining the whole entire time. And my dad echoed that when he went and saw you too. He still to this day talks about how he wants to come back and see your pig farm. So I think that's a huge asset to being a hygienist is being able to talk in such a way where you're entertaining and fun, but you also don't require a response. I know you're gonna be really missed by a lot of your patients. Um, one of the common themes doing your checks recently is I'm gonna have to find a new hygienist and no one else has ever cleaned my teeth. So you've got a following and they are all going to feel really sad when they come in six months and you're not there. But I know that even though you're going to be missed by them and your work family, the best is yet to come for you. You are going to have a lovely retirement and you have so many great things and memories to make ahead of you. So congratulations on making um, such a wonderful career and entering into the next phase in your retirement. I thought I'd share some eye candy with a dear friend. Connie, you gave me this card to cheer me up years ago. I appreciated your concern, thoughtfulness, and kindness then and ever since. Your light truly shines bright. I can proudly say you have been my friend and work family for almost 23 years. You are one classy Christian woman. I wish you the best always. I know your retirement will be filled with family, love, adventure, and fun. No one deserves it more. Thank you for the advice and love you have given me. The best is yet to come. Relax, <clears throat> enjoy, and just keep, keep working. Love you lots. Congratulations, Miss Connie, on reaching retirement. Our time together hasn't been very long, but it's been filled with nothing about you being kind and helpful. Uh, I know from when you took your break for your recovery that uh, all your patients had nothing but good things to say about you. And I know that you're very, very much around you. Good luck in your next adventures. I know that you're going to give it as much energy as you gave your career as a hygienist. And they better be looking out for that. Say bye, Miss Bye, Miss Connie. The day has finally come that you are retiring. I know that you have worked really hard to get here and that you've been really excited and it's a day that you have waited for for many years. I wish you all the best and I hope you get to go on all the trips and relax all you want. You will be missed by this office and your patience, but I know that you are excited about this new journey. Congratulations. Hi, Connie. I'm so excited that you're retiring. A little bit jealous, but I am really excited. I know your future is gonna be great, spending it with the grandkids and Keith all the time. Um, don't forget us, we love you. Come back and see us and we'll go to Brooklyn for some pizza once in a while. Hey, Hollywood. I think you know how much your patients love you and how much your work family loves you and we're going to miss you so, so much. I hope you just take all the advice I've given you from the AARP magazines and you know how to live comfortably through retirement, enjoy traveling, your family, and we sure are going to miss you. And especially Keith. I'm surely going to miss Keith the most. We love you, Connie. Bye, Hollywood. Enjoy the next chapter of your life. Hey, Miss Connie. I just wanted to wish you a happy retirement. 
Um, I wish you the best of luck with everything. I've really enjoyed working with you. We're really gonna miss you. Honey, the day has finally come. I'm so excited for you. I'm jealous. I just want to come on here and tell you, um, back in 2001, when I came to work with you, um, you were just, took me right in like you'd known me forever. Um, we've been through births, deaths, wins, losses, hard times, good times. Um, you were just like family. And I just want to tell you that I thank you for your encouraging words, the times we've cried together and laughed together, and how excited I am for you that the day has finally come, that you get to spend your time just like you want to. I'm jealous, very jealous. But I want to come on here and tell you how much I love you how excited I am for you, and I hope you make the best of every single day and celebrate. Love you. Honey, happy retirement. I love you. And I'm going to miss you something fierce. You are an awesome woman of God and a wonderful sister in Christ. I know you love your family very, very much and you're very blessed to have such a warm, loving family. I wish I was really your sister, <laughs> but I know you always tell me I am. I'm really happy for you. You are a wonderful, wonderful person. And I hope you really enjoy those sweet little grand boys and time with Keith and your children. And just know that I'm sad, but that you're leaving, but I'm happy for you. And I love you very, very much. And I hope you enjoy your time off permanently. It's permanent. Hey, neighbor. Just wanted to tell you congratulations on your retirement. I know you are going to live this next chapter of your life amazingly. Um, Thank you for being so welcoming to me when I came in the beginning. I appreciate it. Your kindness was not unnoticed. Um, now that you're retired though, I know who to call for pickup for my child at school if I ever need it. Just kidding. All right, you will be missed by so many and by me. I hope you have a wonderful retirement. Bye. Hey, Miss Connie, and happy retirement. You're going to be well missed around here. Um, you welcomed me in five years ago with open arms, and it's been a journey ever since. Um, don't be a stranger. Come back, and whenever we have any kind of parties, please bring your punch. Happy retirement, Miss Connie. I am very thankful and blessed that I've been able to work alongside with you um, the last almost five years. You have taught me a lot, and I'm very blessed to have all the memories we've had together as co-workers um, and as a office. Um, I know you're very excited to not ever see any blue new patients anymore. Um, but yeah, thank you for everything that you've done for me and for the office and for being a great friend um, in life. So I hope you enjoy your rest and spending time with your grandbabies and Mr. Keith and traveling, doing all the things that you will enjoy doing once you have retired. But yeah, thank you so much and I love you. Bye. Hi, I've been very blessed to get to know you in the very short few months that I've been here. And you have been so kind to me and so considerate and made me feel so welcome here. 
and try to do anything that you could to make me feel comfortable and welcome and I just want you to know how much I appreciate that. You will be greatly missed by everyone here I know and your patience and I will greatly miss you as well. And I'm so proud of you and hope you have a wonderful retirement and just relax and live it up. Of the time that I got to spend with you. Hey Connie, this is Hope. I just wanted to wish you a happy retirement and I'm so happy for you. I'm going to be in your shoes one day. We're going to miss you so much at work. You're an awesome co-worker and your patients are going to miss you too. Happy retirement and good luck on this new adventure. Hey Pearl, it's retirement day, the long-awaited day that you have looked for for so long. Anyway, number one, congrats. I'm so happy you get to do this and be surrounded by all the things that you love. Um, number two, that 18-year-old girl sitting on the floor crying her eyes out at Dr. Moore's office all those years ago can do nothing but hand you the kudos for her career. You picked me up that day, you wiped my tears, told me what I needed to do, and I did it. I listened to you and I became a better dental assistant. I became a better person. I became a stronger person. I became a better mom. I became a better wife and I owe it all to you. So I am blessed to have worked with you 25 out of my 29 years in this career. Um, you're amazing. You're gonna be missed by all your patients. Oh my gosh, there's gonna be so many that's gonna miss you. However, I am so happy that you get this, you and Keith get to spend this time together um, living your dream. And um, who would have thought all those years ago, me, that 18 year old girl sitting in that bathroom, that our paths would have crossed so many times as farmer's wives, our paths crossed as your brother and my dad being best friends. Now they're in heaven together and then, you know, your sister-in-law marrying my cousin. I mean, oh my gosh. It's amazing how such a big community can be so small. And I'm so, so honored and so happy to be in your circle. I love you, girl. Congratulations. You deserve nothing but the best. Enjoy. Go catch some fish. Love you, girl. Bye. Thanks, Connie. Congratulations. I know you've looked forward to this day for a while. You're retiring. Um, I know you've got a lot of trips planned. Um, you're going to be spending time with your grandkids more. I just hope you have the best time. Um, don't be a stranger. Come by and see us from time to time. Um, we'll take care of your patients as we transition. We know we can't replace you, um, but you will definitely be missed, and that's all.